got this from Joann's Fabric. It's a faux fur knit fabric. Grab some paper and a ruler and start making your pattern. The first line that you can draw is just a long straight line and that's going to determine however long you want your cardigan to be. From the bottom of that line, draw another line out. The wider you make this line, the wider your cardigan is going to be. So the longer it is, the wider your cardigan is. At the top of the line, I drew another small line out and that functions as the top shoulder part of your cardigan on the back. Then I extended that line out even further to be the start of the sleeve because I wanted the sleeve to be attached to the body. Next I drew another line down that is wide enough to make it so that the sleeve's not tight on your body. Then I connected the opening using a curved line up near the underarm of the sleeve to give it this cool hanging off the body effect. This is just a close-up of my very amateur small scale drawing of what my pattern does look like. On the right hand side you can see there's that weird rectangle shape and that's optional if you want to add some more sleeve length to your pattern. The dotted line is for the neckline on the front pieces of the cardigan. So just be sure that that shape on the left, you're going to cut two of those for the front side, not on the fold, and one on the fold for the back piece. So this is what my two front pattern pieces look like all cut out. The back piece is exactly the same except for they're not cut down the middle. So now that everything's all nice and cut out, I laid my pattern pieces right side together and I'm just going to sew the top seams that go on your shoulders and the sleeve seams that go from under your arm all the way to the bottom. I just folded the inside corners here. I just folded them so that you could see that I have right sides together. This part got a little crazy because it is a faux fur fabric, but since it has a knit backing, I just went ahead and used my serger to sew up the side seams and the top of the shoulder seams. This was a little time consuming just because the faux fur is so thick, so just take your time and make sure that you catch all the seams properly. This cardigan is actually super easy to fix if you accidentally make the cardigan too bulky and too wide on your body. All you need to do is just take away from the side seams. Now the next step here is to just go ahead and finish all your seams however you prefer. I do recommend for hemming this type of material, anything that has long fibers, you want to hem it by hand. And I know that sounds like a hassle, but if you sew it with a machine, you're going to end up with something that you can see through here. Um, so it would be laying down a whole bunch of hairs, and you don't want that. You want all the seams to be hidden. So I just went ahead and turned everything and sewed it by hand. And that's it. Now you have officially added a fluffy cardigan to your wardrobe.